Welcome to Gisaria, Italy and the ever-hospitable Hanglu Speech, the venue that houses a selection of top kite surfing events every year, and this year the Kite Surf Tour Europe is no exception. The event includes both freestyle and course racing divisions, but for the freestyle competitors, this is a crucial event on their kiting calendar. It's the European Freestyle Championship and everyone has their eyes on this prestigious title. What makes this place unique is the punctuality of the sea breeze. The conditions are relatively calm during the morning, allowing the riders some time to relax before racing, but it is almost certain that the wind will build by lunchtime and the conditions will be ideal for racing. And so it happened today, and the course racing division wasted no time in hitting the water for some windward leeward racing. The 25 men and 4 women participating here were set to race together in one strong group. With the 2013 World and European Champions here, the level is very high for the week. As expected, Florian Gruber from Germany, 2013 World Champion, and Olly Bridge from the UK, 2013 European Champion, were engaged in battle today. Bridge felt strong competition in the same place where he won the European title last year, and it certainly showed today when he managed to score four out of five bullets and lead the fleet. In second place was Italian rider Riccardo Letzese, and despite his world champion status, Gruber finished the day in fifth position, but there's still plenty of time to climb the leaderboard. It's rare, we got a super nice place. You got side, side crush your wind, uh, thermic every day, 15, 20 knots, really nice. In the freestyle division, the riders waited patiently, testing out some new moves and wowing the spectators with crowd-pleasing tricks out on the water. Unfortunately, the wind was not strong enough for the freestylers to compete today, meaning that they will kick off their races tomorrow. Hopefully they have made some use of their extra day's practice. So stay tuned for more action tomorrow from Hanglu Beach and the Kitesurf Tour Europe as the kite surfers take the water for day two.